Do you know if this is a sea lion or a seal? What about this one? Or this one balancing a ball on its nose. As a child, I always thought I was watching a seal doing tricks when I went to the circus. But today, I wonder what I was actually watching do those tricks. Since the majority of these type of marine mammals performing at the circus are sea lions. Not all, but most. It's relatively common for seals and sea lions to be confused with one another. But there are some pretty big differences. A big one being their limbs. Look at this seal attempt to climb the ladder. It's trying really hard, but can't seem to get up it. It's pals like, come on man, you can do it. Move along, move along now. Then you have a sea lion attempting to pull a bin of toys into the water. Oh my goodness, it did it. So did you notice that the sea lion had a bit of an easier time getting around on land than the seal did? That's because they're able to take flippers and rotate them underneath their bodies to use them similar to feet in order to get around. In the water, seals use their back flippers to swim by fanning them out and moving them in a side-to-side -side motion. Sea lions use their front flippers for swimming and their back flippers for steering. Now let's look at each of them side by side. Notice any differences in their ears? I'll give you a few seconds to spot it. Did you figure it out? A seal has ear holes. A sea lion has ear flaps. Maybe they were designed with these flaps as a way to plug their ears when another fellow sea lion just won't hush up. I mean, can you imagine trying to nap, having to listen to another sea lion barking all of the time? You'd want to yell, hush up! Who knows, maybe some of them are. Seals don't have to deal with their fellow seals doing this since they tend to be much quieter animals. By the way, sea lions don't plug their ears with their ear flaps. At least, I don't think they do. Do they? Anywho, moving on. Seals are also smaller than sea lions, weighing an average of 330 to 450 pounds and being 7 to 8 feet long. Sea lions can weigh up to 850 pounds and be 7 feet long. But are seals or sea lions aggressive? Typically no, but there was a time recently that sea lions were poisoned by a toxic algae bloom, causing them to be more aggressive when approached. During this time, there were reports of them biting children and even people's butts. But typically, neither a seal or a sea lion are aggressive. Oh, and one more thing. Sea lions tend to be solid in color, while seals can have splotches on their bodies. So tell me, do you know any interesting facts about seals or sea lions? Let me know in the comments below. See y'all next time. Bye.